Hi guys and welcome back to a Premier League prediction video. Now, this is getting interesting because things are starting to take shape. Last weekend we had a cracker, a Man City versus Arsenal, that was a very, very good match, very entertaining, ended 2 all. The Trossard red card did ruin it a little bit because you always felt that City would get back into it, but Arsenal did a very good job holding them off. And unfortunately for Arsenal, Man City did breach that defence at the last kick, pretty much, of the game. You also had a couple of what felt like six-pointers with Leicester against Everton and Ipswich against Southampton. Now, correct scores, there was one, and it was Leicester v Everton. I put 1-1, one, one, so that was correct. But then out of the other nine games, I actually got seven of the results correct, which I was pretty happy with, considering there were quite a few draws in there. And... The two that I got wrong was I had Ipswich to beat Southampton 1-0 and I had Newcastle to beat Fulham 2-1. So a pretty good set of guesses, but not perfect because I'd love one week to just get every result right. However, that's pretty difficult. We're going to get into this round now, so make sure to like and subscribe. And we kick things off with Newcastle against Man City. Now... <sighs> Newcastle are strange because they're picking up results but they're not playing too great. They did lose to Fulham on that last weekend. So, And then City, supposedly without Rodri for the rest of the season. Newcastle are a lot better at home than they are away. It could be a tight one, but I just think City might edge it with a lot of the attacking threat that Newcastle tend to have not really performing. So... I'll go 2-1 to Man City. Arsenal against Leicester next. This used to be a very good fixture when Leicester were last in the Premier League and near the top of the table. Arsenal-Leicester was always such a good game. Jamie Vardy seemed to always haunt them. Whether he can do something again, I'm not sure. I should probably go for Leicester's score, but that Arsenal defence is so good that I am going to back Arsenal to win 2-0. On to Brentford v West Ham. Now, Brentford have been pretty good so far. West Ham, very lacklustre, very poor under Lopetegui so far. And you're kind of thinking now, you know, they'd be better off with Moyes. But there's time to turn it around. But I do kind of think that if they get to round 10 and there's still no real improvements, then maybe Lopetegui will be replaced. Because... They aren't picking up many points at all. And I don't think they will here. I'm going to go for Brentford to win 2-1. Chelsea against Brighton should be a good fixture. This is one of the ones I kind of highlight for this weekend because it's a shame it's a 3 o'clock in a way for the neutral. But I think there'll be goals. Brighton look strong this season. Chelsea also look like they're going to do a job. So I'm going to go for goals and the points shared 2 all. Forest v Fulham could be a tight one this. Forest still unbeaten, which is quite a surprise. Fulham have started very well this season, so I think if I had to back anyone to win, it would just be Fulham, but I'm going to go for another draw, one all. Everton against Palace. Now, Everton don't seem to have much of a problem scoring, it's just defending, defending Leeds especially. So I'm going to go Palace here. Haven't had a great start, but things seem to be starting to come together. So Palace to win 2-1. Wolves v Liverpool. It's going to be interesting because Wolves have apparently got an illness hitting their camp. So it looks like... I mean, Liverpool would win it anyway, you'd expect, but it looks like it could be quite severe. So I'm going to back Liverpool to win... We'll go 4 0. Why not? On to Ipswich against Villa. This should be a good game. And I've got a feeling Ipswich have done pretty well so far, you know. Yes, they lost their opening two against Man City and Liverpool, but since then, three draws proving to be hard to beat. I'll go for a draw here again. 1 0 Ipswich Villa. Man United v Tottenham. I don't think much of United. I think Spurs are coming into it 
Solanke's getting a few goals under his belt now. So I'll go Spurs to win 3-1. And finally, Monday Night Football, Bournemouth against Southampton. Bournemouth has looked good every time I've watched them, but they're not picking up results. as They're not picking up as many points as they probably deserve, based on the way they're playing. However, Southampton don't score many goals at all. I think Bournemouth at home will win this comfortably. I'll go... 2-0. So those are my predictions for these fixtures. Make sure to get your predictions down below. Like and subscribe and I'll catch you next time.